from Cincinnati here for Game 5 of the Kelly Cup Finals. Mike Benton with you. Outside Kentucky in the background here joining us, Aces Veteran Center Jordan Morrison. Two game-winning goals here uh, in these finals, of course, two for uh, Cincinnati by Jonathan Hazen. Uh, we've seen a bit of a pattern here, obviously, but as far as your side is concerned, in close games, in tight games, third period, what have you admired out of how the Aces can battle when the chips are down? Um, I think we've uh, been pretty relentless in our game. Uh, you know, even the first couple games when we got down, uh, we battled back, and it shows a good uh, test of our character, but um, you know, sometimes you just don't get the bounces, and uh, that was the chances last night. It seems to be the mentality here for this team again, with the stakes being raised steady as she goes, correct? Yeah, that's uh, that's a key in playoffs. Any time in year, really, you don't get too highs when uh, you, things are going good, and uh, when it gets low, you just got to remember that you know we always have a game the next day. So that's our mentality right now. Just uh, don't worry about things from last night, and uh, just it's a new day. And it is a pivotal game five here, but maybe a benefit with having back-to-back uh, -back games in as many days here, and with that chance to finally just let game four move on and pass you by, right? Yeah, it's good to get it over with, and. Um, yeah, like we said, we got a game tonight, and hopefully we can rebound. Uh, I'm sure all the boys are going to be just fine. We're not too worried, and uh, just got to keep getting shots on net and outshooting the other team, and, you know, the levy's going to break out at some point. With that, the Aces out shooting Cincinnati 32-16 to and mentioning the scoring chances were there. Can you really look at the amount of grade A chances that were at the front of the net from last evening and think we can even take that and improve? Yeah, for sure. I don't think we played our best game by far last night. I think we were a bit sluggish. And um, yeah, we just didn't capitalize on our chances, myself included. Uh, you know, we had a bunch of great A chances that we didn't we didn't capitalize on. You got to give credit to uh, Midori. He played an unreal game. But, um, you know, if we keep uh, giving as many shots as we have, I think it's just a matter of time before we get those goals. Early in your career, it began in the Eastern Conference, and that meant trips out here to U.S. Bank Arena to face the Cyclones. Heading into this Kelly Cup final series, any thoughts maybe pass you by as far as previous playoff performances and thinking, I want one back in a series like this? Um, yeah, I think my first year of pros, uh, I was over here in Cincinnati playing uh, in our first round, and you know it didn't go the way we wanted. But uh, you know that was many moons ago. I'm not too worried about it, and I like our squad and what we're doing here. So I think we're going to be just fine. Maximum three games left now in the regular season, and. We go back to the whole steady as she goes mentality. And in a pivotal game five like this here, we think about how big games can be. But what do you hope that your teammates can bring as far as a mentality out of their locker room and out of the first period in the first few minutes of this evening? Um, I think we're just going to try to play fast, aces hockey, and get the puck in behind the defenseman and try to work them uh, in the offensive zone like we know how. And, you know, I think that's played dividends all series. And hopefully uh, we've been tiring out their D. So. That's our game plan. Just get pucks on the net and try to work it low in the offensive zone. All right, Jordan, thank you. Good luck here. Thank you. Appreciate it.